this okay welcome back to another day of training guys um let me tell you guys something yesterday it was 84 degrees that that's the high it was and now today it's only 50 and there's a north wind blowing and it's kind of cold and i'm kind of debating whether i should go get pants on or not i probably will just to warm up once i warm up i'll probably end up taking them off so i'm gonna set you guys down here on the trampoline and then um i'm gonna stand on the brick and uh some pants are gonna magically appear on my legs so it's gonna be a lit magic show for Got some nice pants on now, guys. Um, shoot, the wind. Yeah, I'm gonna be training today. I'm gonna warm up on the trampoline again with some stuff. Stuff, what am I saying? Probably a few Cody's and double fulls and stuff because today I'm gonna plan on doing a bunch of double twisting because I really need to get those down because I've not been doing that lately. And I have a competition coming up and I need to have those prepared. So yeah. Alright, so my back's feeling better today, but I do need to stretch it out. I should probably stop right now and stretch out before I do anything else. I'm gonna stretch it out real quick, and then I'll be back to you guys. I'll get back to you guys, not be back. I don't know what I'm saying. Bye. I'm not used to the weather being this cold, so I think I'm gonna go inside and warm up because it's killing me. I can't feel my hands or nothing, and I'll start working on double fools. So yeah, see you guys in a sec. Transition now. I guess I'm not really feeling it today either. Usually I do double H twists like they're nothing, but you know, not every day's perfect. And two days in a row have not been perfect. Hopefully by the comp they'll be good though. And also I just need to drill a few double fulls still. And I want to at least get a double H twist cleanly landed at least once. So yeah, uh, we'll continue with our training and ciao. All right, so I think I'm done with those. Uh, they'll probably come back to me tomorrow whenever I train. But now I kind of want to work on the scoot double fulls. I can usually do double fulls really easily. The only problem is the scoot, my scoot, up onto like the vault box is awful. And so I need to really start drilling that. That way I can get more power out of it. Because there's no power at all coming from my scoot. I must set a time limit for myself to work up to it in four minutes because I always hesitate way too long. All right, I think I could just throw it now. I still got 
over a minute and a half to go. Let's see if you can see it there. But I can do it right now. I just have nobody to hype me up to for the commitment. But I can commit on my own. I know I can do it. All right, I'm just going to go. And I got 10 seconds left. Barely. I hesitated a lot in that last minute. I'm going to do it again. Clean it up. Keep freaking out last second on the on the scoot part. I need to not do that. And I can't freaking feel my hands and it hurts. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know, just keep pumping these out until I land it and then I don't know. I'm tempted to be done. Yep, I'm not feeling it anymore. And I don't know if you ever train alone, but it makes you like, the first one's always the most hyped, and the second one's eh, and the third one from there just goes downhill. Because there's no one around to hype you up. Vlogging actually does help me, so I like doing it whenever I'm training alone. I think I'm gonna start ending it, and I'm gonna start working on some tramp skill stuff. How about this, I'm just gonna drill 15 double folds before I stop training. I'm okay, I'm, just, I'm gonna stop packing. Stop it! Okay. Yeah, it's getting kind of dark, so the GoPro can't even see much, and it's kind of getting grainy, and I'm not gonna really be able to film anymore. I could probably still train for like 10 more minutes, but that's about it. So I'm pretty much done for today. That's it for this one, guys. Make sure you go like, comment, share, and subscribe. Uh, yeah, sharing's important, because that's what gets me known out there, if you guys really like these ones. And that's it. That's all for this vlog. See you guys, quit watching now, bye.